Hello, my name is Jennifer and welcome to my short tutorial on how to get your shortcut back on your desktop for The Sims 4 after the November 12th game update. So you may have noticed that since the November 12th update that your shortcut on your desktop or where it is doesn't look like it goes anywhere. It's missing The Sims 4 logo. So if I click on this, it tells me that the item ts4.exe that this shortcut refers to has been changed or moved so it no longer will work properly. Then it asks if you want to delete it, which is quite easy. You can say yes, you can say no. It doesn't do anything either way, but essentially the shortcut no longer works. So what you need to do to get that shortcut back is to go where your new executable file is, which is the default location is showing here because mine is in the default location. But you would need to look where yours is if it's not here and you can find that out on Origin. So mine is under uh, Program Files, x86, Origin Games, The Sims 4, Game, and then Bin. And then you can see here, this is the executable file. Because with the update, they've now made it that it requires a 64-bit application. It's just a new application that's been created. So what you want to do here is you want to right mouse click on that. Then you want to create a shortcut. And so you'll see now that my shortcut is right here. So you can just drag it as it is to the desktop or you can edit it so that it doesn't have that shortcut name on it. You can still tell it's a shortcut because it has a little symbol there that indicates it's a shortcut. Then you can take that and drag it to your desktop and you can see there that it's saying move to desktop. Now if I was to double click on that, that will open my game and it'll essentially open Origin in the background. I don't want to do that right now, but that's just to show how to get it onto your desktop so that if that's how you like to get in your game, you're back in business and you have your shortcut. But that's going to be it for this video. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye. This has been Jennifer. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below. I'd love to see them. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more videos of challenge, let's plays, tutorials, and occasional speed builds, please subscribe if you haven't already done so. Thanks very much.